welcome to today's video. I am so excited. I don't know how I got so lucky, but this is the third year in a row where I am grateful enough to be working with a brand for a spring break haul, and that is exactly what today's video is. If you're new, hey, I'm Michaela, and today we are going to be doing a spring break haul. I'm super excited about today's video because it is actually in collaboration with bloomingjelly.com. They're an online clothing brand. They have wonderful prices, and they were nice enough to sell me eight products to try out and to share with you. They were also nice enough to give me a coupon code, so if you want 30% off of the entire site, use my code Mich Kayla 30 and you will get 30% off anything on their website. It does expire on the 31st of March. So don't hesitate. Use this now and get 30% off. I decided to go with a theme for the clothes that I picked out. I wanted to do like a spring break haul. So I have some bikinis, some cute tops, and then really, really cute dresses that I cannot wait to wear this spring and summer. I wish I had a vacation destination to go to because these outfits would be perfect on the beach or somewhere tropical or honestly just anywhere near water. And I am super pumped to you it's going to be a try and haul everything that I share with you in this haul will be linked down below so if you want to get your own pair of whatever it'll be listed in the description box with all of that being said don't forget to give this video a like comment down below if you're going anywhere for spring break and where you're going I'm super jealous but that just means that a vacation further down the road is waiting for me and I am very excited for that one also don't forget to subscribe we really are like one big family with lots of love to go around and it's never too late to join all you have to do is hit subscribe also don't forget to click the bell because this notifies you every time I upload a new video and I always shut out the first comment on my social media so be sure to be following me on those as well. With all of that being said, I have a pile of clothes in front of me. Let's dive right on in starting with the swimsuits. If you've seen my, I think it's from 2016, so it's pretty outdated at this point, but if you've seen my swimsuit collection or any other bikini try-on hauls that I have done, I love swimsuits. I live in Minnesota, so I don't really understand why I have so many of them. This could be a little redundant if you've watched some of my old videos about this, but I think it has to do with the fact that I wasn't allowed to wear two-piece swimsuits growing up, like literally until I was 16 or 17, and I just went against my parents and bought myself a bikini but until then they would not let me wear a two-piece and created a lot of like negative questioning about my body and how come I wasn't allowed to show that I get the whole modesty thing but at the same time I don't consider it to be inappropriate like it's 2019 let's get with the times but because I missed out on 16 years of choosing swimsuits that I wanted to wear I think it's a really big reason why now like I cannot control myself and I purchase a ton of two-piece swimsuits I try to wear them as often as I can so starting with my favorite piece that I found on the website. We have this super cute orange gingham bikini. It's a two piece. As you can see, it's got the gingham checkered pattern and this swimsuit ties in the front, which is super nice when you have smaller boobs like me because it can allow you to kind of adjust to the girls closer to create the illusion that you have cleavage. Also, what's really great about this swimsuit is that the straps are adjustable and oftentimes on websites like this, you may not get the option to adjust the straps so when I find a swimsuit like that it's just even better because there's a likelier chance that it'll fit my body type I did not realize when I purchased this though that the bottoms are they look so weird like this like they're just so high waisted but they kind of just look like baby bloomers on so it doesn't really work with my body type I don't know if I'm going to be able to wear this gingham set together but I am definitely going to be wearing the top piece with some bottoms that fit my body it's just super super long it doesn't look that flattering on my butt unfortunately the bottoms just were not for me I'm still really excited about this bikini because it's just super cute and I think orange is a really good color on me with my darker features especially in the summer when I am tanning so that swimsuit definitely gets a thumbs up from me because it is still adorable the next bikini that I chose is also super super cute. I went for something a little different I don't have many swimsuits like this and that is just the basic triangle piece bikini This bikini has little pineapples all over it, which is super adorable and again just tie straps Triangle bikinis either work or they don't with my body type just because they have a tendency to not stay in place If you don't have the support that some may have to keep them there, but I think we're gonna be okay with this one I really like the way the bottoms look on me I think it's super flattering and it fits my body really nicely but again, the bottoms are the same pattern. Cute little pineapples. I already know the Instagram caption that I'm going to pair with the swimsuit if I ever take a picture and post it on Instagram. So definitely be following me on social media to see what that is. But I love that swimsuit, so I'm definitely giving that one a thumbs up as well. And I hope that I'm able to wear that when summer does arrive. The third swimsuit is by far my absolute favorite, my absolute dream. I'm so happy that she fits like a glove. It is the sweetest, darlingest, cutest thing that I have ever owned. It took me by surprise because I don't normally gravitate towards pink swimsuits. I know that probably sounds
sounds super funny because I'm literally in a pink sweater with a pink couch and a lot of pink accents around the room. But this baby is absolutely perfect. It is just this two-piece pink and white striped bikini that has a little tie in the front. It looks kind of like a sports bra and what I mean by that is that there are no adjustable straps so I took a really big risk and it paid off because she fits like a gem. It is perfect. I think it's really flattering on my body type and the bottoms are my absolute favorite too because they have the little detail that I love in swimsuit bottoms and that is the little slits on the sides of your hips. I like this because it shows more skin and it creates these really fun tan lines that you can have in the summer. Also, I think the bottom is super flattering on me as well because it's a little smaller and I like that. <laughs> By far, this baby is my absolute favorite. She's a dream. I think she would be super fun to wear on a boat, so I definitely need to make that a summer bucket list item this year is to go on a boat and just have like a boating day. But like imagine the pics and how cute, how cute. Oh, I'm so happy with this. Thank you so much. Definitely two thumbs up for this baby. So those were all the swimsuits that I have. Next, let's get into the tops that I chose and then we'll get into the dresses. I'm saving the best for last. Definitely stay until the end. Next, I have this super cute light pink tank top well it's like a businessy tank top and i chose this because i wanted to find some tops that i could wear to work this spring and summer without overheating or just still having that professional look and i think this one definitely does it's light pink has buttons and then a cinch around the waist as well as this cute little tie on the chest area it's a tank top but it's really thick in fact for me it is four fingers thick so depending on your workplace i'm sure this is appropriate for me this is definitely okay for me to wear and i compare this with either dark jeans leggings I think white jeans would be super cute but I think she is just adorable definitely my, one of my favorite colors I really like the gold buttons in the front and the fact that I can wear this to work I could wear this out it all depends on what I pair it with to create that look super super cute giving this a thumbs up as well because she's adorable and she fits my body type so it's a win-win next I took a little risk out of my comfort zone and picked out another top that I wanted to be able to wear to work but also have more of a casual look to it as well and that is this plaid zip up t-shirt that cinches at the bottom it has one of those like tie looks but I like the zipper because you can make it modest like if you're 10 or if you just are have bigger boobs and you need more of the zipper to cover up your cleavage or you can make it really immodest I like it just about right in the middle I think that works well for me but I'm really happy that I gave this a try it's also a color that I typically wouldn't gravitate towards but especially when I'm working with clothing brands I try to go out of my comfort zone with style choices and take some risks because I really have nothing to lose and I think it's just fun to try new things so this is definitely one of those but now I have this super cute top that I could wear to work I could wear for fun it's great it's a nice casual piece thumbs up love it on to one of my favorite things that I got in this haul it reminds me of so many things Things, but overall it just makes me feel happy even just thinking about it looking at it and especially when I am wearing this I never thought I could pull something like this off but the second that I tried it on I was like wow I don't look ridiculous I really like it <laughs> that is this adorable adorable sunflower dress like Oh my lord. The sunflower dress has ties on the shoulders so you can adjust if you want it really high or really low depending on your bra size most likely. But it has these adorable little brown buttons in the front. It is a mid calf length dress which I'm 5'2 so I never thought I could pull that off. And surprise I can pull it off. I don't look like I'm two feet tall when I have it on. In fact it reminds me of my childhood when I used to wear dresses that length. And it makes me feel happy because it's yellow which is my favorite color and has sunflowers which who doesn't love it makes me feel like summer is here and it's springtime it's just a happy dress so I'm really glad that it fit and that I feel good in it I cannot wait to wear it and make some memories and hopefully take this somewhere on a vacation this year I would love to go somewhere hint hint so that is by far one of my favorite dresses that I got the second dress I had high hopes for but unfortunately I'm not really sure how I like it on my body let me know what you think because again she's a little out of my comfort zone but I stuck with what I know best and that is yellow it kind of has like palm trees on it but it's it's just this mustard yellow dress and it does kind of go out at the bottom it reminds me of like a cheerleaders outfit the way that the skirt poofs out but it's super cute it reminds me of something that like influencers would wear on like a tripping with tart trip to somewhere tropical or if I were ever to go to Mexico for spring break like I would definitely want this to wear to dinner or something she's super cute she also ties at the shoulders so you have these cute little bows but let me know what you think because I do really like the color and the style and it does it makes me think that I should be wearing it barefoot on the sand somewhere so definitely 
definitely a thumbs up from me because yellow, tropical, sand, dress, all good things. Last but not least, we have such a beautiful piece. I'm so happy to have something like this in my closet. It makes me wish I had an event in my life to wear this to right now. It fills me with such joy. I'm so happy that I have this, but it is by far my favorite thing that I got. And it is this beautiful, amazing, white, pink and red floral off the shoulder maxi dress. And she is beautiful like honestly even like on video I feel like it doesn't do her justice but she has a little tie around the waist which is great because with maxi dresses they can sometimes look like an oversized bag on you or they can really fit your body type but this one is adjustable and she does also button in the front. This maxi dress is longer in the back than in the front, but not dramatically like that 2012 trend that we all went through. Just a little bit, which helps show off your shoes, especially when you're 5'2". Again, because I am so short, I have a hard time finding long dresses like this that fit my body type, but this one is amazing. I think it looks so good on. I feel really good with this on, and it makes me really happy. Again, it's just a beautiful color, beautiful pattern. I cannot wait to wear this. I hope I have like a fancy dinner date or again on a boat or somewhere tropical I, I can even see myself wearing this in LA I cannot believe that I went to California five times last year and so far this year I haven't gone at all it's just a really big contrast and it does make me a little bit sad so I have to go back to the West Coast soon because I have all these new outfits to wear and no place to wear them and no one to take pictures of me in them, which we all know is a thing when you've got new clothes. Anyway, those are all the things that I got from bloomingjelly.com. Thank you so much for watching this video. Overall, all eight pieces are beautiful in their own way and they all work with my body, minus the swimsuit bottoms, but again, it's just harder because it was high-waisted and I'm, I'm small. I definitely think this website has great pieces check them out down below if you're interested and want to wear them on your spring break vacation. Also, don't forget to use my coupon code Michaela 30 for 30% off of your purchase. Or summer vacation, again, comment down below where you're headed. I'm so jealous and I hope you have a great time. But with all of that being said, Marnie and I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day and we'll see you very soon in my next video. Bye. I really, really want to zig a zig off. A little too late, a little too long. I do not like white wine. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Into the sun. I just got my period. <laughs>